Aloha, welcome to Real Talk with Sandy. I'm Sandy Hale, retired nurse and Redan and Fields consultant for the last six and a half years. Today's product video is gonna to touch on all of our sunscreens. Every one of our regimens, and we have four regimens, um, each of them come with a sunscreen, and then we also have additional sunscreens that are in our radiant defense and our mineral peptide. So I wanna cover them with you, go over um, how each of them differ because I myself am on the reverse regimen, but I do use a different sunscreen. So I wanna share how you can mix and match for certain days or certain things you know that you're doing. So first, this is our reverse sunscreen right here. So this is the only sunscreen that has 50 plus broad spectrum and just FYI for you to know any sunscreen that you're using you want to make sure that it's a broad spectrum You want it to cover UVA and UVB rays Because both of them you need protection from and of course it is the Sun's rays It's the UV light that actually causes us to wrinkle right age quicker those free radicals in the air and so we want to make sure that we're taking care of our skin so our reverse sunscreen here, this number four, this is our 50 SPF. So this also though has vitamin E and green tea, and then it has licorice extract and mulberry extract, and that helps to brighten and give our, our skin a you know, not so dull look. And of course that's perfect for reverse because if you're on reverse, it's because you're trying to reverse your, your sun damage, dull looking skin, you want it to be brighter, you wanna have um, that glow. And like I said, I use the reverse regimen. That's my go-to. So our next one here, this is our Soothe, number four, this one. And as you can see, it is, um, it's our only mineral sunscreen. This is also water resistant for 80 minutes. So out of all of the sunscreens that we have, guys, this one's water resistant for 80 minutes. It's a 30 SPF. And because it's mineral based, it also protects without compromising your skin's delicate moisture barrier, right? For those people who are utilizing Soothe, it is because you have sensitive skin. I use this with my reverse regimen. And the reason is because this is a mineral based sunscreen, when I apply this, it's almost like um, primer where it mattes my face. And so I like that. Um, if I am gonna be spending the day out in the sun, like we're going to the beach, we're going to watch my daughter's softball game or my um, niece's softball game or a baseball game, or if we're gonna spend the day out in the sun, then I am for sure putting on number four. But if it's a regular day, like today, where maybe I'll go out and go shopping or I'll do some errands, but for the most part, I'm at home, then, or I'm indoors, then that's where this one comes in. So I will use the Soothe number four mineral sunscreen for that. Um, what this also does is because it's part of our Soothe regimen is it does calm and soothe uh, visible redness. So this is our unblemished sunscreen and this is a shine free, oil free sunscreen. It is formulated for people who have acne prone skin. So this has 20 SPF broad spectrum again, and there's also vitamin C to help brighten your skin tone. So our next one is our Redefine, and our Redefine actually has only three steps. So as you can see, the other ones were all number fours. This is a number three. This is our daytime moisturizer slash sunscreen, and this has a 30 SPF. But like I said, it also moisturizes. So there's a dimethicone and hyaluronic acid, and that's how it moisturizes your skin. And then there's also powerful peptides in here, and this helps to reduce fine lines and wrinkles. So I am a Radiant Defense user. This is what our Radiant Defense looks like. It actually comes in six different shades, but the Radiant Defense here, um, this comes in 30 SPF if you are in the US or Canada. It's 25 SPF if you do live in Australia. And this is actually a hybrid skincare. It provides sun protection while providing perfecting aesthetics. 
So our Radiant Defense, guys, it's tinted. Um, like I said, it comes in six different shades and I utilize this. So after, whether I'm applying Soothe 4 or I'm utilizing my Reverse 4, I go ahead and I put Radiant Defense on over that. Now, for myself, some days I do this, some days I don't. The other one that we have is mineral peptides here. Okay, so it looks like this. Our mineral peptides are also SPF 20. So you see how you are kind of putting another layer of sunscreen over. These come in three shades, so it's light, medium, and bronze. And there are quite a few people that I know, they utilize Radiant Defense, but they use our mineral peptides as like setting powder. It's lightweight, it gives you that protection, but because it's lightweight, it doesn't sink in um, to any wrinkles or you know when you start smiling and you get those creases and laugh lines sometimes because foundation is so much heavier so that's why people love the mineral peptides it's really light and it always sits on the top so it's never going to sink in and it's never going to accentuate whatever fine lines wrinkles creases that you have on your face so i utilize this sometimes as well um, just to kind of give it it's more so maybe during the day like it's been very hot recently you know and it's really humid here in Hawaii and so what I'll do is do, during the day maybe if I'm getting ready to go out really quickly I'll just put a little bit of this on and then go um, and that's it so these are the different types of sunscreens guys that we have know that they're interchangeable like I said I use two different ones just depending on what I'm doing um, so it's really up to you know that if you are somebody who's on spotless or if you uh, have a teen or a young adult that's on spotless then I would 100% highly recommend them being on one of these whether it be radiant defense and reason is if they're on spotless they're fighting acne so what's great about radiant defense is this also helps both of these actually help to decrease the visibility of redness and both of them will not clog their pores and both of them will not cause breakouts. So it's not, it's not um, where you're you know, fighting to cover it up and yet you're causing more, which is right, what foundation does. So if you have somebody that's on spotless, I would highly recommend that they get on some type of sunscreen that they need to add to it. So if they want that coverage because maybe they've got the red skin or they've got some, um, you know, current acne right now, then this is great coverage for them to just help, you know, help them to feel better, feel more comfortable in their skin. Guys, thank you so much for joining me today with Real Talk with Sandy. Subscribe to my channel. You can share this video. I'll have my link below. So if you do want to purchase any one of these sunscreens, you definitely can go to my website and do that. Um, you can purchase the sunscreen completely by itself. You do not have to get it with a, um, with a regimen at all. Uh, you can get them separately. So it's a, definitely a great way um, to make sure that you are saving your skin from the UVA and UVB rays. Aloha.